Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Top Tries. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the Lamborghini Urus Finals. Our first finals after the huge RQ500 update. So let's see how we will perform in those. Currently ranked 54, but not too bad. I mean, 6 win, 2 loss. That's fine, that's fine. I mean, currently we would be in tier 3. That would give us a carbon fiber pack, that will give us a Cadillac XT5, but I must say, tier 2 is looking very, very interesting. I don't know if I have a chance, I really don't know if I have a chance. Uh, Bentley and Tiger Diesel, that would be great. I mean Lamborghini Urus, obviously, that would be the bomb, but let's, let's not fool ourselves, right? let's try our best. So this is what I came up with, um, like here, by the way, I saw it now what Hutch meant. For example, if I drop this guy here, it shows me how many points exactly on the slot there. If you see it there, it's right here, tells me 100. 100 points is what I can still do. Um, I was looking for this when they told about it and I kind of, uh, it's funny, like I looked here like somewhere, I looked here, I'm like, where is it? Where is this? Like, this one? It's actually pretty cool because if you drop those guys, you see what you have the, the average. The average amount of points you can use now is 96. Pretty cool, pretty cool. That's definitely helpful considering the whole uh, 500 RQ update. Um, since we, yeah, we just multiplied everything with three and a half almost, and that's why it's definitely helpful. So, however, this is my deck. I mean, I could, I could switch on the TTRS plus coupe, but it doesn't make sense. I want to keep the roof 3800s. It's just better. It's better than 0 to 60, has a better mid-range and better handling. So this why I want to keep that baby. By the way, yeah, non-price cars. Ha ha ha. So <laughs> I'll always love this. But okay, I think for some people it doesn't really make sense. But um, I wonder which price car here. I forgot. Oh, maybe like... Uh, is this Spider? No, Spider's not. Or maybe some of those. Or M-A-G-T-E. BMW M8 GTE, is that one? Is that one 2000? That must be, right? I mean, that one's so brand new, wait a second. Yeah, that one would be part of it. Okay, whoo, lucky for me. So we're not going to face those guys. However, yeah, that's my deck and let's go into it. Okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah, let's try. Let's try Christoph Lagarde. So obviously this is like, it's actually pretty simple. I was playing it already. So um, I'm always dropping this guy there. City Streets Medium. This is a job for the 330D Touring. Standard tires and so. Then we got a highway and we got a car park. <coughs> and we got a fast circuit. Fast circuit, that's a job for him. City Streets Medium is going to be tight, I must say. Going to be really tight. Like, we got a four-wheel drive on that RS5 Cabriolet. That's going to be interesting. Then, um, for Twisty Road, yeah, man. This is actually the Kaiman GTS. I saw this one a few times. Good epic there. Good epic there. Probably going to beat my Roof 3800S. That's fine. That's fine. Then we go in, in for Car Park. I drop this and Highway. I drop this. So, hopefully I can win Highway and Car Park. Then I'm feeling pretty safe that I can win the whole thing. So, okay, my Max out R6 Avant is still doing a great job there. I mean, I can switch on this car as well, but I'd rather keep the AMG SLS Electric. Finally, I could use this car. I mean, like, seriously, I have this car for such a long time, and I barely use it anymore. It's like, I used it in the beginning more, that's why I have, like, uh, some people were like, CMG! You have so many races on this, how can you say you never used it? I used it back in the days in the beginning because it was like, it belonged to one of my first legendaries and obviously used it then a lot. But now with like the tons of cars they dropped on us since, I don't know, since I started Top Drives. Um, it's definitely different. Okay, 330D Touring, 4088. 4088, can I, can I switch that? But it's kind of sad, I maxed this ultra rare out and I want to kind of keep it, you know? Like, okay, however, let's see, tier two. I wonder if I can do something different. Wait, I cannot go, no, Medium ground clearance, interesting. I could switch that. 
488 was beating me. What happens if I can... Oh! 410! Hello there! This might be safe. Okay, can we have the same guy again? Oh, perfect. There we go. I take... Take this. That's, I just want to try this. I just... Just maybe... Did something really great. Let's see. Um, he goes there. He goes there. Okay, this dude's medium. If I would have tons of ultra rares now, that would be great. I mean, those two first cars are maxed out. Then this one is not maxed out. If it would be maxed out, this would definitely make a difference there. Yeah? Then we got him. Yes! Woo! 1 3 1 3 1 3 1 3 1 3 2 3 my friend. Hey <laughs> hey! And here this is going to be interesting. But yeah. Okay, that's a better choice. Good to know. Good to know. Nice. Tier 2 my friend. Tier 2. Hey, that mentally would be amazing. But before we're getting too excited, let's have a quick look how full this bracket is. Do we have 500 people already? Then we know. 300, 350. Come on, give me 500. 400, 450, 500. Ooh, nice. Let's see the top. How is it looking there? Oh, oh man. 23, 1. But people take a lot of hits here. Frank, he has 9 hits. Oh, top prize 11, 447. 10 hits. 9 hits for Blaine. 6 hits only. Oh, look at this, 02027. I want to see this guy with 19 hits. So, can we find this? Okay, let's see if we can find this guy. 19 hits. How how bad is this deck? Or how good? So, if I can beat him, then I don't have a chance. 02027. Okay, let's see. Probably not here yet. No, no. Okay, then let's go smaller. Okay. Ooh, someone makes this baby out. Let's not go against this guy right now. Okay, we can go against this. That's fine. Car park. Four-way drive standardized. That's interesting. Highway, I can beat. Twisty road, I cannot beat. Fast circuit, I can beat. City streets, medium, I can beat. And highway road, I can beat. So, highway, I go here. Car park. I don't know if I can beat him. It's going to be interesting, but it is a, it. It's see. Wait, wait, one second. Let me go quickly back there. Yeah, it's that car park. That car park is a bit different than the usual car park where you just do your circles. Here you have a little bit of like a little bit of acceleration you need. So uh, three, eight, nine, three, four, nine. let's see about this one. Okay, R6 avant. 69 points. Audi S1. Someone got that tier one price there. Yeah? yeah, that's what I mean. You see, yeah, it's a bit different. Okay, good. So we can beat the four wheel drive sanitizer. Yeah. That's nice. How great would it be to have that Kaiman GTS right now? That would like complete my deck, kind of. I think here really comes down to, I feel like my deck is pretty good. It really comes down to one point. How many people in my bracket have this kind of deck maxed out? Let's see. Oh, look at this one. So, where's this guy? 02027. Man, we just jumped him. Let's see. There's he. Okay. Interesting. I do have... Da, da, didn't I have this car? I don't know. But he might beat me. Yeah, yeah. That's most likely. Then he has... Oh, poo. That's a good deck, man. Okay, Ooh, let's think. Um, oh, this is not easy. Um, we're going to lose on car park. We're going to win on happen road. We're going to lose on car park. We win on happen road. And then there's a question. Okay, G force test. We can beat him. 
We should be able to beat him with our SLS electric. And Hepburn Road. Well, well, it's maxed out. It's maxed out I8. We could. Hmm. City Streets Medium is interesting. I mean, it's, it's a it's a great drag star in that way. I don't know if it's meat for City. I want to test it. Let's test it. That's interesting because I got way more handling on City Streets Medium, and let's see if this will be helpful. Um, this is a loss. Uh, this should be a win. Then we have here. Okay. We need to try it. Okay, he goes there. I mean, we have less. We do have less handling there. But I hope for the mid range. Let's see about this. Oh, this is going to be a super interesting deck. Let's see. Okay, that's a win. Even some extra points. Yeah, 64 might be useful. Let's see. Okay, then this. If I can win this. Oh no, he's beating me. Mm, not good. Okay. Whoo! Okay, now it all comes down to City Streets Medium. If I can beat him there, then I'm safe. If not, well, then not. Then we know. Wouldn't it be great if my roof 3800S would be maxed out? But okay. Okay, we go here. Oh no! <gasps> oh no! Traction control? Better mid range? Better mid range? Mid range? <laughs> Better mid range on GeForce test? Oh, this is. Okay, this sucks. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. And this guy got so many losses with this surprising deck. Ah, crap. Not good. Okay, well, um, then I can definitely count myself in for a lot of loss on my side. So, um, wow. Wow. Better mid range on. on you surprised me, man. You surprised me. I'm sticking to that. I'm not gonna switch. Oh, wait, one second. What, what am I doing? Now I'm like, I'm kind of like... Okay, so we have a win on Happen World. We have a loss on Car Park. Uh, this one on Happen World, we should win. Uh, I hope he doesn't have secret mid-range. However, he doesn't even have all-wheel drive. So the rest we should win. Better mid-range? I understand the concept of mid-range. Don't get me wrong there. Absolutely not. Um, however, GeForce test in mid-range is always... Sometimes Todd Rice is still surprising you. You know, you played for years and then you have a loss and you're like, yeah, cool. <laughs> so... So, okay. I mean, let's be honest. Let's be honest. We could have found someone else, probably, to make it into the top 10. But I must say, whoo, this will probably be, this will be a tough, a, it would be a very tough fight for me. It would be a very tough fight. I mean, if this guy, this, um, where's this guy? Do we push him up? Did I see him somewhere? I probably lost. There, he's right, up, right in front of me. If this guy got 19 loss with this surprisingly funny deck, with like better mid range on GeForce Test versus Audi, then, then, well. Plus, I do have an issue. There's, we, we have different if, issues, here. <laughs> issues here. Sorry. Number one is obviously you don't know if maybe the top ten already, kind of like teamed up together and they're not going to fight each other and they only fight everybody who's getting close there maybe that's why this guy 0207 got like yeah like tons of hits maybe because he's always getting close he actually has a better deck than those guys but they just like bully him down so this could be one thing another thing is what i realized is that uh, since yeah, many people love to watch Top Drives as well on YouTube and, men, and then many people come to my channel and they see me sometimes in a prize board, somewhere here in, in, in a leaderboard and so They love to fight me and then they even send me on Instagram. I mean, that's 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 a beauty <laughs> That's a dark side of, of having the Top Drives fame a little bit <laughs> Whenever they find you, they're gonna beat you 
So and so my, and my deck is not unbeatable. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Unfortunately, I cannot really max anything out there. It's like, can I? Do I have any ultra rares I can drop? No, I have epics I can drop, which I most likely will not do. Um, I don't even have one ultra rares, so that means going and opening now ceramic packs doesn't make sense as well. And then again, opening uh, here, going ahead and opening here a German carbon fiber pack. By the way, by the way, one thing I do not like. Um, why does Hutch? Well, I mean, we all talked about this so many times, but one thing I do not like is actually the amount of carbon fiber packs. Hutch is offering 15 carbon fiber packs, which can be helpful or absolutely not helpful for your final experience. And um, I do not like that there's a big amount of that because kind of let's let's be honest. If someone has a very easy credit card. <laughs> And then he can just like buy all, all the time those 15, 15, 15, and eventually he will get an, an unbeatable deck. And that kind of sucks because that kind of takes away the whole strategy point of, of top twice in my eyes. I don't know, just my two cents for this. I did open 15 back in the days as well, and we had this big um, carbon fiber disaster. My last nine carbon fiber packs, and since that, I told like at, at least in, in the month of May. If there's not the most amazing offer coming, I will not open a single carbon fiber pack. Like for gold. I will I will not go down the road of disappointment for this one. Absolutely not. Ceramic packs it is. There there I'm ready to get disappointed, but I'm ready as well to just like use my cash there. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did so, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. You make me very sad. Give me that little gift of a subscription on this beautiful weekend. And it's sunny out there. After you watch my video, definitely don't forget to enjoy a bit the sunshine as much as you can do. If you can go outside, you can go outside. If you're not allowed because of, you know, the stupid virus, then maybe just open a window and look a little bit outside. I don't have a balcony as well, which is a, a sad thing. And I realize I definitely, my next apartment needs a balcony. So, however, wish you a pleasant day. There was a casual more Vegema, and I'm out.